Hi, this is Terry White. I'm in my Stitch Studio today. And uh, I want to show you a couple of things I was playing with on a play day. And it was So Soft Paints and some old crochet motifs. Here are some snowflakes that are crocheted and they're old. So I got some So Soft Paints and I painted them in all kinds of beautiful colors. I had some bell-shaped crocheted ornaments so I did the same treatment. Here is an arrangement of bell flowers. Now, I was experimenting, I was just playing around, and this turned out much better than I thought it would. These were white crocheted bell ornaments. They had been um, stiffened with starch, and they were really old. And I painted them with so soft paints. And because of the way I painted them, they turned out looking like flowers. Now this one is still retains its bell shape. These flowers were bigger bells. See, there's the clapper. And I turned them inside out and formed them into these cool flowers. Isn't that neat? Here's one that still retains its bell shape. Okay, so what I do was I turn it inside out because I painted the outside of it, but I also painted the inside of it. But what you will we'll see mostly um, is the inside of it because of the way it's going to form. Now, these were starched before uh, I painted them, so they're very stiff. When you paint with the So Soft paints, they don't stiffen... Um, they don't stiffen the project. So it's just a matter of deciding how much you're folding this back to get the shape. And then see I can pull around the edge here so that that green edging will look like petals. Push this in. Pull out the little stamen, which is, of course, the um, handle for the bell. And I can form this any way that I want to. The biggest bell that I had and I painted it blue and it had a really you know big inside needed something extra so here um, was one of the smaller bells and I'll just uh, stitch that in to the center of that so I get this this really cool flower. Here's a purple one. After painting the bells and shaping them into flowers, I made this little arrangement. Um, these parts are wooden shapes that I also painted. Okay, Let's see. So, I'll play with these shapes a little bit more and make make an arrangement and I can put this in a shadow box I can stitch it to a handbag I can make a little garden for a doll um, to me it's um, playing with shapes and playing with textures and, and materials creating vignettes and um, later on I figure out what to do with them so <laughs> when people are so what do you do with that uh, whatever I want to so um but it's really fun to upcycle old pieces, old things, creating really fun new things, and then figuring out what to do with them. I hope you enjoyed it. 